Another name for an inchworm is a measuring worm or canker worm. The inchworm is also called a caterpillar. He eats away the leaves of trees and plants. The inchworm moves along slowly, inching his way across the ground. Inchworm reads eh, eh, eh. I reads eh, eh, eh. Inchy the inchworm will climb up a hill. Oops, a bird. Inchy stays still. Inchy inchworm was an inchworm. Inchy inchworm travelled by moving his body section by section and inch by inch. It was a pretty good way to travel. Inchy inchworm always got where he was going, but it seemed slow to Inchy inchworm. Inchy inchworm really admired Itsy Bitsy Cricket. Itsy Bitsy Cricket could take long, big hops and cover distances that took Inchy inchworm a long time to travel. I want to jump like you, Itsy Bitsy Cricket, said Inchy inchworm. Yes, you really move slow, Inchy Inchworm, said Itsy Bitsy Cricket. Well, sooner or later I get just about anywhere, agreed Inchy Inchworm, but it would be much more fun to jump and hop as you do. Too bad you can't, little Inchy Inchworm. Watch me hop to the other side of that big rock. In one big swoop, Itsy Bitsy Cricket disappeared from Inchy Inchworm's view. Oh, how I want to jump, moaned Inchy Inchworm. All I can do is inch, inch, inch along, an inch at a time. Just about that time, Inchy Inchworm noticed a bird flying to the limb of a nearby tree. Oh, I'd better be still, Inchy Inchworm thought. That bird looks hungry to me. I think he'd love to have an inchworm for lunch. Quick as a wink, Inchy Inchworm flattened himself out and stayed perfectly still. Itsy Bitsy Cricket at that instant came hopping back. Itsy Bitsy Cricket was really showing off a little because Itsy Bitsy knew Inchy Inchworm wanted to be able to hop like him. Not only was Itsy Bitsy Cricket jumping extra high, but he was making a lot of noise. Look at me! Look at me! I jump high as a tree! Itsy Bitsy Cricket sang out as he jumped back and forth around Inchy Inchworm. Do you suppose Itsy Bitsy Cricket doesn't see that bird? Inchy Inchworm wondered. That bird just might like a cricket for lunch. Itsy Bitsy Cricket, you better look out! yelled Inchy Inchworm. Suddenly, there was a swoop from a nearby tree and a whirring of feathers. Inchy Inchworm closed his eyes tightly and stayed as still as possible. When he opened them again, there was no cricket to be seen. Itsy Bitsy Cricket was gone. Even though Inchy Inchworm was saddened to lose his friend, he sighed. Phew, it's a good thing I can't hop. I guess inching along is pr a pretty good way to travel after all. It's better to be me inching along and doing things just the way God made me. What was Inchy Inchworm? <laughs> yes, he was an inchworm. How did he move? Yes, he creeps along inch by inch, centimetre by centimetre, bit by bit. Who did Inchy Inchworm wish he could be? Yes, he wanted to be Itsy Bitsy Cricket and to be able to jump. As Inchy Inchworm crawled along, what danger did he see? 
Yes, there was a bird who was perhaps looking for some lunch. What did Inchy Inchworm do to protect himself from the hungry bird? Mm, he flattened himself out and stayed very, very still. Did Itsy Bitsy Cricket see the danger? No, I don't think so. Was Itsy Bitsy Cricket wise? Not really. Was he showing off maybe? Who made Inchy Inchworm just like he ought to be? That's right. God our Heavenly Father did, didn't he? Listen as I tell you a word. Can you hear the I sound? Brick. Can you hear the I sound in the word brick? Yes, brick has the I sound. Ill. Can you hear the I sound in the word ill? Yes, ill has the I sound. Huge. Can you hear the I sound in the word huge? No, huge doesn't have the I sound. Row. Can you hear the I sound in the word row? No, row doesn't have the I sound. Miss. Can you hear the I sound in the word miss? Yes, miss has the I sound. Milk. Can you hear the I sound in the word milk? Yes, milk has the I sound. Off. Can you hear the I sound in the word off? No, off doesn't have the I sound. It. Can you hear the I sound in the word it? Yes, it has the I sound. Pull. Can you hear the I sound in the word pull? No. Pull doesn't have the I sound. Hiss. Can you hear the I sound in the word hiss? Yes, hiss has the I sound. Listen as I read you a sentence. Can you find the word that has the I sound? Brick houses are strong. Can you hear the I the word with the I sound? Brick houses are strong. Brick. Brick has the I sound. Do not come to school when you are ill. Can you find the word that has the I sound? Do not come to school when you are ill. Ill. Ill has the I sound. Miss Jones loves me too. Can you find the word with the I sound? Miss Jones loves me too. Miss. Miss has the I sound. Joseph and Mary couldn't stay at the inn. Can you find the I sound? Joseph and Mary couldn't stay at the inn. Inn. Inn has the I sound. Sip your fruit juice slowly. Can you find the word that has the I sound? Sip your juice slowly. Sip. Sip has the I sound. Let's blend these sounds. M, I, M, I, M, I, S, I, S, I. S, f, e, f, e, f, e, f, e, r, e, r, e, r, e, b, e, b, e, b, e, n, e, n, e, n, e, g, e, g, e, g, 
에, 트, 에, 체, 퍼, 에, 퍼, 에, 페. Let's blend these sounds into words. 스, 에, 트, 스, 에, 트, 셋, 셋, 프, 에, 트, 프, 에, 트, 펫, 펫, 퍼, 에, 트, 퍼, 에, 트, 펫, 펫, 바, 에, 바잇 빗 빗 음잇 음잇 밋 밋 프에스트 프에스트 페스트 페스트 음에스트 음에스트 메스트 메스트 it, sp, it, sp, it, spit, n, i, p, n, i, p, nip, nip, s, i, p, s, i, p, sip, sip, p, i, p, p, i, p, pip, pip, r, i, p, r, i, Rip, rip, t, i, p, t, i, p, tip, tip, p, i, g, p, i, g, pig, pig, f, i, g, f, i, g, fig, fig, b, i, g, b, i, g, big, big, r, i, R egg, rig, rig, b e b b e b, bib bib, r e b r e b, rib rib, s t e f f, s t e f f, stiff stiff, p e n p e n Pin, pin, t, i, n, t, i, n, tin, tin, s, i, n, s, i, n, sin, sin, f, i, n, f, i, n, fin, fin, b, i, n, b, i, n, bin, bin, s, p, i, n, s, p, i, Mm. Spin, spin. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4, 13a. Sometimes we are afraid we cannot do the things we ought to do. Mother will ask us to do something and we will say, but I don't know how, or I'm afraid I can't do it right. Sometimes we simply whine, I can't. We should not be afraid. We must trust God and be confident. Remember this verse, I can do all things through Christ. God asked Moses to do a big, big job. He told him to lead God's people out of Egypt. Moses loved God and he wanted to do what he said. But he did not feel very sure that he could do it. Moses was keeping sheep one day in the desert and suddenly he saw a bush that looked as if it was on fire. Moses saw an angel in a flame of fire out of the midst of the bush. Then he noticed that the bush burned with fire but was not consumed. That means burnt up. God called to Moses out of the bush and said, Moses, Moses. And Moses said, Here I am. God said, Don't come any closer, Moses. Take off your shoes because you are standing on holy ground. I'm sure Moses was frightened 
Then God's voice continued. I am the God of your father and of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. Moses was so afraid that he covered his face. He was afraid to even look at God. The Lord said, I have seen how my people are being mistreated in Egypt, for I know their sorrows. I am going to deliver my people out of this land of Egypt and take them to a good land. Come, Moses, and go to see Pharaoh for me. I am going to use you to lead my people out of Egypt. Moses fe feared fa Pharaoh because Moses knew that Pharaoh would not want the people of Israel to leave Egypt. Moses began to think of his own weakness rather than remembering the strength and power of God. Who am I, Moses said, that I should go to Pharaoh and that I should bring the children of Israel out of Egypt? God said, I will be with you. Moses thought about that and he knew that if God were with him, he could do what God wanted him to do. Moses asked God, When I come to the people of Israel and tell them you sent me, what will I say? God answered Moses, You must say, The God of your fathers sent me to you. And they will say to me, What is his name? What will I say then? asked Moses. And God said to Moses, I am that I am. That is what you must say to them. Say to the people of Israel, I am has sent me to you. God told Moses how the kings of Egypt was not going to let the Israel, Israelites go until after God performed wonders. Moses said to God, but behold, they will not believe me or listen to me. They will say, the Lord did not really appear to you, Moses. God gave Moses three signs that Moses could show the people of Israel if they did not believe that the Lord had sent Moses. One of the signs was that God turned Moses' walking stick into a snake and then turned it back into a walking stick. Still, Moses was fearful. Boys and girls, you know how sometimes you want to say something and it just doesn't come out right. You know what you want to say, but you can't think of the right words. That is what Moses thought would happen to him. Moses said, Lord, I am not a good speaker. I am slow of speech and my tongue doesn't work right. Then the Lord said a wonderful thing to Moses. Moses, who made man's mouth? Moses knew that God made his mouth. Who makes one person not able to talk or another person not able to hear or another person not able to see? I, the Lord, am the one who gives the ability to talk or see or hear. I can give you exactly what you need. Now go and I will be with your mouth and I will tell you exactly what to say. The Lord finally sent Moses Moses' brother with him to help him speak. But God said one more time, I will be with your mouth and with his mouth and I will teach you what you shall do. Finally, Moses realized that God just wanted Moses to depend on God, trusting God to care for him. God did care for Moses and Moses did lead the people of Israel out of the land of Egypt. Just as Moses could not fail when he did what God wanted him to do, Neither can you fail when you do what God wants you to do. Exodus chapters 3 and 4. Character objective. Confident. To learn to all, do all things with Jesus' help. When we have the assurance that whatever we say or do will benefit us and others, we are being confident. Sometimes we feel we cannot do very much. Sometimes we are afraid or lonely or not sure we can do the right thing. Who is it that gives us our tongues? Yes, it is God. He will take care of us. We should never be afraid, but trust God to care for us and help us in anything he sends into our lives. When we love the Lord and do right, 
God will make things work out for our good and his glory. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4 verse 13a. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4 verse 13a. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4 verse 13a. Say it with me. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4 verse 13a. One more time. I can do all things through Christ. Philippians 4 verse 13a. Inchworm reads, eh, eh, eh. I reads, eh, eh, eh. Inchy the inchworm.